What is up you guys? Welcome back to my channel. If you are new here, my name is Lindsay. I am a fashion beauty lifestyle creator over on Instagram, TikTok, Pinterest, and YouTube. It is the second week of the month, which means it is Amazon week. And today we're gonna to be doing fall wedding guest dresses. I have a wedding coming up at the end of September on the 23rd. So I've been ordering a bunch of dresses to try on, see what I like, what I wanna wear. The attire for the wedding is cocktail. I have five dresses to show you guys today and I'm not gonna lie, as I was trying these on, they just got better and better and better and now my decision is really really hard so i'm gonna need y'all to help me out in the comments and tell me which one i should wear to this wedding okay let's get into it starting with this ruffled blue number i thought the color of this was so stunning i feel like it's a really good transitional color for bringing summer into fall i actually don't wear a lot of blue so i was a little shocked that i wanted to try this out really good midi the material is super super well made and i honestly really loved the fit of this i felt like it fit pretty well i did a size medium it it has this elastic right here to help hold the top up. My only complaint was this little triangle at the top did keep wanting to kind of like flop over. So I'm not too sure how to keep it stiff and standing. It did zip up all the way in the back, which was really nice to get in and out of. And overall, I really liked this dress. Like I said, it's just this little thing right here that was kind of annoying me. And this does come in a few other colors. So if you don't like this blue or it's not your favorite, there is more options for you guys. Okay, this next dress I absolutely loved, you guys. Like, I'm keeping this no matter if I wear it to the wedding or not. I feel like it would make a beautiful date night dress or if you have any other event to go to. The silhouette of it is just absolutely stunning. I love the little crossover around the legs. I feel like it's very flattering. It kind of dresses up the fact that it's a mini dress. I'm so used to wearing, like, floor length and middies to weddings to be a little bit more classy. I never really go for a mini style, but I feel like this one is so nice and so well made. Absolutely love the back of it where it has that little cutout. I feel like that gives it a little sex appeal. If anything, this is the perfect LBD. Like this is the ultimate event date night dress. You want to look refined and classy, but you also want to look sexy. I did a size medium in this too. I really love the neckline of it. I love the way it fit. It does zip on the side. It just was absolute perfection and it steamed out really, really easily as well. This third dress was the bride's favorite based on the like Amazon pictures that I sent her because she loves the color of it. It goes well with her color scheme. She kind of wants everyone to be in bright colors she didn't like tell us that but she every time someone sends a dress she always prefers the like pastel brighter color that way you're kind of on theme i love how expensive this dress looks like the silhouette of it the mermaid style it's giving revolve for a fraction of the price it's actually very well structured it has this little v right here that has some wiring it does have the pads inside so you can kind of lift the girls up if you want. Straps are not adjustable so that could be an issue if you do have a larger chest. You could maybe size up. I had the issue kind of of my chest not really filling it out but it is what it is. Zips all the way in the back and also all of this ruching is so flattering. Like if there's anything that you're uncomfortable with and that you want to hide even though it is more of a bodycon fitted dress all of this ruching is so distracting that you're going to be hiding whatever you don't want anyone to notice. I also love how it goes to a really flowy bottom. I just feel like it's so pretty. Never worn a dress this style before, so I don't know how comfortable I am in it. It is really, really pretty, and it is a top contender. I just don't know if it's the one. You're going to have to help me out in the comments. I'm not even playing. I'm a Libra. I don't make decisions for myself. This dress just screams fall to me because of the color. Funny enough, this wedding is on my four-year wedding anniversary so our four-year wedding anniversary is september 21st and the wedding is on the 23rd so it's literally the same weekend that we got married and my color palette for my wedding was blush and this like rust color so something about this color just screams like fall wedding to me september wedding so that's why i kind of want to wear this dress and like why i'm so in love with this color I also think that this color looks really good on my skin tone with my hair and my features. I will say it is a little tight, but I don't think I could size up. I feel like if I sized up, it would be falling off in the top. It zips up on the side. It's a little hard to get into. I have to like pull it down, zip it up, and then shimmy it back on. But I like how it has that little open back like that black mini dress did. This is really flattering. 
You can also wear Spanx with all of these, you guys. I was wearing my long shapewear that has the boning in it, which is also from Amazon, and you couldn't see it in any of these dresses, which is a huge win for me. Even with these back cutouts, it was absolutely undetectable. It does have the little elastic sticky right here to help hold the girls up. I think this one's gonna get like a seven or eight out of 10 just because it's so tight right here. But for color, 10 out of 10. I love this color. I will always love this color. Last but not least, we have another black dress. I feel like choosing black dresses is just such an easy way to go. Like, when in doubt, wear black. That's my motto. And this one has ruching on it like that sage green one did, which makes it very, very forgiving, and it literally hides everything. I also wanted to include one that had sleeves because I'm the type of person who is pretty self-conscious about their arms, especially in pictures around big groups. So if you are like that as well and you opt for sleeves, this is a really good option. One zips up all the way in the back. It does fit snug. It is very, very true to size. It's the size medium. There's no room for stretching or anything. It's not uncomfortable, but it's not big. Like there is no room to grow in this one. I feel like this would also make a good date night dress or even if you're going to a bachelorette and she asks you to wear black. This is a pretty sexy option. I actually have this dress kind of in a one shoulder like brown that I wore to a wedding in January. So I knew I liked the designer or the shop on Amazon. I knew that it was going to be really good material. So I went ahead and opted for the same style dress, the same brand dress just in a different style my friend actually wore this exact dress to that wedding where i wore the brown one and she looked great in it we have five really good options i still actually have one more dress from amazon on the way one coming in from asos and then i think i may and try to order a couple from shopo so i'll probably be sharing those on like instagram stories make sure to follow me over there and i will see you next time